opposite an electric motor. And away he goes. This is Joko with an auto gyro. It's airborne. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. We've had very few of these models ever fly. And here are these perfected and electric ones. That blade on top has to spin at a certain RPM. If it gets too slow, only one side, the side going into the wind, will fly. That makes you do an immediate roll. And usually you don't recover before you hit the ground. So he's got that gyro going at the right RPM to keep him airborne. And he can control it. He goes in a nice round, well, an oval anyway. Banks that into the turn. He flies really well. He's got an elevator and a rudder and power. And that's how he's controlling it. The rotor is just there. It just provides the look for him. You can see that slow down to the point where he's not making any forward motion. The pen when he increases the RPM of the electric motor, it increases the RPM of the rotor. Because that's what's giving that rotor its speed. Wow. This hangs it there. Now, your helicopter went upside down, Joe. And, and we wanted to see this go upside down. Why are you trying to get it down? <laughs> oh, oh, I hear that. I'm trying to get it down. I thought you were going upside down. He's trying to land it. But he has to force it onto the ground, and it stays in one piece. Joe Cole! All right.